performing in the second semi-final from Denmark, it's Riley! Now I remember I used to tell you all my deepest fears When fighting You use them just to pour some tears Hey guys Just uh, like Riley, you are bringing the love with your handbag, with your balloons oh, And lollipops! Yes, <gasps> you guys want one? I have to hand it out oh my God, It's signed it's, as yes. well, so you're welcome yeah. Oh, this is oh, going to be a collectible, you. isn't Cherry, it, to the very Eurovision nice. fans? Have them out I'll sell it for... <laughs> yeah. Great amount of money. <laughs> exactly. Lovely. This is amazing. I would say welcome to Liverpool, Riley, but your stylist and your manager are from Liverpool. That's is that right? right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So do you know much about the city? Not, not much. I feel like I should know more, but I know a lot about the UK because I've lived here as well. So oh, okay. I loved seeing new places in the UK. Good, that's good. Yeah, you traveled a lot. By by the way, uh, you are the first per person from the Faroe Islands uh, to represent Denmark at Eurovision. Mm, how much of an honor is that for you? Oh, that's such an honor. I mean, that's huge, obviously. Um, I wasn't even aware that I was the first person until after I won in Denmark. But, I mean, it's such an honor. I feel really grateful and excited, but there's a lot of pressure as well. I want to do well for everybody back home and do them proud. Definitely. Yeah. For anyone who's not been there at Faroe Islands, how can you describe um, in a couple of words uh, what is it about? Well, the Faroe Islands is a really tiny country, a very small nation that's a part of Denmark. We're only 50,000 people. It's actually 18 islands that sort of comprise the Faroe Islands. And, and one of them yours, yeah? Yeah, one of them is really, I own one, just kidding. I bought one, no, I didn't. Um, when and, you win your vision, you well, can Well, maybe buy after it. With, with the money. No, it's really just a really small community. Um, it, there's a lot of big mountains and um, a lot of really great nature. It's beautiful. It sounds beautiful, doesn't it? And you've said previously that sometimes you feel a bit lonely. You wish you were part of a group. So how do you get yourself in the right frame of mind when you do take to the stage on your own? Oh, that's a good question. I think, um, yeah, I mean, it definitely can't be lonely being sort of a, like the only person, like a solo act on stage. I think, you know what, I, I find a lot of uh, comfort and confidence in my like outfits. You So you should. Does that make like, sense? Yes. Like when you're on stage, like I have a really big prop on my Eurovision stage. So I, when I'm there, I have my outfit on and my hair. I feel like now I'm like, I feel like at home I have someone with me. <laughs> You said that your studio essentials are jelly beans, water and your phone. But what one item could you not live without? I'm, it has to be hairspray, doesn't it? Because uh, You know what I mean? Yeah. Like you have to just lock it in place. Look good, feel good. That's exactly right. Yeah, and you always look good. Oh, thank you. <laughs> maybe just get some British rain. Oh no, please no. No, don't oh, my God, this, you can't do that. It's totally it's blue skies. That, that would ruin the balloons, it would ruin the hair. Oh no, 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 no <laughs> We no, can't no. have any rain. No. <laughs> <laughs> Riley, thank you so much. Thank You're amazing. You so and much. Uh, yeah, enjoy the rest of the thank lollipop you. giving out. Yeah, enjoy and the thank lollipops. You for the lollipops. Yeah, yeah. We'll have yeah. that as a snack, won't we? Bye. Thank you very thank much. You. Good luck. Yeah. Here he is, the heartbreaker Riley. Don't worry, we've put lead in his boots. We don't want him taking off with those balloons. We've come too far to lose Denmark. And I'm loving his shirt. There's 15,000 stones on there, which is four more than I've got. And he sewed them on himself with his friend. It took him a whole month to add them all. He's got lollipops in his bag as well. If he could get one sent up to this commentary booth, I would be very grateful. Thank you very much. He doesn't have to bring it himself. I know he's very busy.